I want you to picture a slushy, any flavor that you like. Now really focus on the consistency of that slushy. This could be your diesel fuel if it is gelled or frozen due to ambient temperature changes. You've probably seen, or maybe you've even been one of the diesel trucks stuck on the side of the road in the winter time and wondered what happened. The answer is simply that they took a load of fuel that wasn't ready for that day's ambient temperature. Today we'll discuss reasons why diesel owners should be treating their fuel with additives year-round right here in the Amsoil Garage. This video is brought to you by Amsoil, the first in synthetics. Visit amsoil.com for more information. Hey everyone, I'm Greg Jones for Engine Builder, and today we're talking about diesel fuel and what effects ambient temperature has on it. Managing your fuel is probably the most important attribute to making sure your diesel starts in the winter, especially with common rails. Fuel is the most dependent piece to get your vehicle running and stay running. When temperatures drop, diesel owners need to pay close attention to what's going in their fuel tanks. Typically in the United States, diesel trucks driving east and west don't see as many issues as diesel trucks driving north and south due to temperature changes. For instance, if a diesel truck takes a load of fuel in Missouri and makes it all the way to northern Minnesota on that load of fuel, well, that fuel from Missouri is not treated for northern Minnesota's temperature. He's likely the guy stuck on the side of the road and he's not sure why. The reason is his fuel wasn't ready for the temperature and it gelled. Gelling refers to the wax crystals that solidify in fuel at certain temperatures. As mentioned earlier, your fuel essentially looks like a slushy in this state. It plugs your fuel filter and you can't start your engine. Fortunately, there are ways to manage fuel performance in the winter. You can do it proactively or you can do it reactively. Reactively requires a recovery product. Amsoil offers one that simply goes in your fuel and melts all that wax and the water that was frozen. However, doing it reactively still means you got stuck somewhere, you need to use a recovery product, and then have to wait for it to work before getting back going again. Proactively, there's two things you can do. One, the fuel station itself can help you. They blend their fuel to seasonal averages, and for the most part, your fuel station will have you protected. In general, the fuel refinery and the gas station will blend their diesel fuel to a seasonal average, but keep in mind that's not the current day's temperature. They account for that seasonal average temperature and they add additional protection beyond that to the fuel. How much is predicated on where you are? And each fuel station can differ in what they do. Unfortunately, there's no magic scorecard. When you go to a fuel station and pull the green handle for diesel, you typically get what you get. Now some stations will put a chart on top of the pump that tells you what temperature the fuel is good to given that time of year. An example would be October 15th through November 15th, it's good to zero. Or October 15th to January 1st, it's good to 10 below. What the fuel station cannot accommodate for is big swings in temperature. If it's 30 degrees in Minnesota today, but in a couple days it'll be 20 below, well that fuel is only good for the seasonal average, which is good to zero or maybe minus 10. They don't have it good to minus 20, which means the fuel you just filled up with will be frozen. Additionally, even small temperature swings can freeze your fuel. It just depends on how cold it gets. Within a 20 degree swing from 30 to 10 degrees, you might not see any freezing. However, from minus 20 to minus 40, it could be a bigger deal. So you need to be preventative in your fuel maintenance by running fuel additives that can help you protect from cold weather conditions. These additives are called cold flow improvers. That's the chemistry that will depress the freezing point or the cloud point of that fuel and allow it to flow through your fuel filter to your engine. Amsoil offers a strict cold flow improver bottle, but Amsoil also offers an all-in-one product, which has a cetane improver, a lubricity improver, and the cold flow improver. That product has detergents for cleanliness as well. It's important for people with diesel engines to manage their fuel all year long, but especially in the wintertime. Because of all the variables at play, ensure you're being preventative and proactive by running additives on an every tank basis. That way your fuel won't freeze and you won't be the truck left stranded on the side of the road. I'm Greg Jones for Engine Builder, and thanks for joining me in the Amsoil Garage.